Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a cushion review for you guys and it will be this Too Cool for School Art Class Cushion Foundation. I'm not going to say the full word because I feel like it's in French or something but if I say I'll probably pronounce it wrong but you guys will see the full name of this cushion in the title and in the product mentioned in the description box as well. And the reason why I decided to get this um, cushion is because I really want to try it out after trying this um, Too Cool for School Art Class Studio D10 which you guys will know that I really like a lot if you guys have seen a review that I've done on this one. So I've been using this a lot lately and I'm like Ugh, I really don't want this to run out so I thought try this one and see you know if it's as good as this foundation. On the box at the back it says that this is a moisture strobing cushion compact that adds volumizing dewy layers enhancing facial moisture and volume by each touch and the reason why it says that is because it contains collagen water which means that it helps to moisturize your face and give you that dewy skin that you want now in regards of it giving you that strobing look I don't think it does because strobing is supposed to be like that glowy look this one doesn't really give you that but it gives you more like a semi dewy matte finish which I actually really like because I do have dry skin so I don't like my cushion foundation to be too drying or too matte but this one is actually a perfect formula perfect finish and I really really like it and this is actually how it looks like after running for eight hours so yeah so I thought why not do a review because I'm really really satisfied with this one cushion already this cushion comes in two different shades as well and I got this in the darker shade number two beige and the packaging I just have to say it looks really really pretty I love the details at the front it's not like your regular cushion where they print something but look at that it's just it's so amazing I just love how pretty it is I mean considering that I feel like Too Cool for School is considered like a high-end brand because it's quite well known during in the Western as well so it is sold in Sephora I don't think Sephora sells this though so um, when you open up it's just like your regular cushion where it has a mirror it has a puff which is quite stiff actually like it's quite puffy but I like it and then and the back it has this cushion inside now with this cushion I noticed it's very different from other cushion that I've seen because it has a lot of holes like the holes are actually pretty obvious in this cushion probably because it gives you that moisture I guess I don't know like it doesn't I mean I can't read Korean so I can't really tell you but once you push it you can see all the little holes in there so maybe it just helps to spread evenly on the face that's probably why I'm just I'm just guessing so yeah. In regards of the application, it actually applied pretty evenly on my face which is actually really good. I just have to use the puff and push it down real hard on the cushion to get enough coverage on my face. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do the ratings and I'm going to rate it by the longevity, by the moisture, by the coverage and by the price. So for the longevity, like I mentioned before, this is actually how it looks like after 8 hours. So I'm actually very impressed with how long lasting this cushion foundation is I mean like it still look pretty pretty nice like everything is still pretty intact the only thing I noticed is that it started to get a little bit patchy under my mouth area and um, I can see the lines around my smile line and probably the fine lines under my under eye area as well so what I probably would have to do is probably set um, it with powder around the smile line and my under eye area and probably put a moisturizing primer underneath this cushion foundation since this is since this is not like a moisture moisturizing foundation I can actually do that and the reason why I said that I'm gonna prime before I put this cushion is because I noticed that I could see my pores pretty visible around my um, cheek area so yeah but other than that coverage wise like longevity wise is actually amazing it still looks really really good the only thing is that it doesn't really cover up the um, blemishes but it didn't make it any worse which is okay redness wise I can see a little bit here but it's not too bad and it doesn't make my skin that oily so for the rating for the longevity I'm actually gonna give this 4.5 out of 5 I'm actually pretty impressed with this now in regards of the coverage I'm actually gonna give this 4 out of 5 just because I can see my pores I can see a little bit of my redness and a little bit of my blemish but other than that coverage is about between medium to a bit of high but I mean the shade is perfect for me it's not really too light and yeah I just like the finish of it 
Now in regards of the moisture, I'm gonna give this probably 4.5 out of 5 just because I can still feel something on my face if that makes sense like it's not that moisturizing but you can feel like how at the bottom here is starting to kick up a little bit so yeah 4.5 out of 5 in regards of the price I'm actually gonna give this 4 out of 5 because this is only 16 USC dollars where I got it from but it doesn't have a refill so if you're someone like me who will probably use this a lot now it will probably run up pretty quick and I'll find out if I can get a refill for this because I'm actually not quite sure but overall I'm actually really impressed with this cushion foundation I mean compared to my foundation here it's a little bit different but I can probably use either one of them when I feel like it and I'm actually gonna travel soon and I have a feeling that I'll probably be taking this too with me on my trip just because I like the finish of it and I'm really comfortable with the coverage and I'm just really amazed with this particular brand like I'm starting to really like to cook for a square I'm trying to try out other stuff so if you guys enjoyed this review please give this a thumbs up and please tell me down below if you've tried this before because I think this has been out for a while now and tell me what your thoughts are and if you want me to try other cushion foundation definitely let me know and I'll see you on my next video bye guys